Hey, it's Ellie. Welcome back to another episode of the Mythical Adventures Let's Play series. So today we are going to the jungle for the first time. I'm very excited. We're basically got everything that we need, as far as I can tell, anyway. Let me extract this fossil here. See if we get any cool ones. Yeah, I have no idea if those are cool. Anyway, um, so let's go explore. I believe the ruins are near here. So this is how we have to get there. As far as I can tell, anyway. Here we are. Are any of these lanterns just... Oh no. <laughs> no, you can't take the lanterns. Okay. Well, here we go. Oh, she's just gonna go ahead and view it herself. So let's clear the path of the machete. Oh my gosh, she needs to be in her jungle clothes. Also, she should uh, use this somehow. Can you not use it? Hmm. Maybe I can't use it right now. That's a little confusing. Eventually, she'll get there. There we go. And she disappeared. I lost my machete, though. Uh, Sandra stumbles and drops her bag of personal effects, plop right into a pinch of quicksand. Should Sandra reach in and try to let it go? Uh, well, I only have one machete now, so I can't use the machete to grab the bag. Let's try to get it. Quicksand escape. Sandra looks for anything nearby that could help grabbing a stick. She carefully perches on the edge of the quicksand. She hooks the stick under the strap of the bag and pulls hard. The bag pops free of the sand and the force of the pull causes her to fall back right into a hidden cache of adventure gear. Wow. That's pretty cool. So, now we're on the jungle side, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Alright. So we've just got to walk through, I guess. What did I get from that cache? Anything useful? Oh, doesn't say. Alright, let's see what's up ahead. Ah! <gasps> A snake. Oh god, watch out for that. Let's do some excavating. And then we're gonna have to go... Oh my gosh, where is the next thing? <laughs> All the way over here. I don't get why I can't use this from my inventory. I can't get that one either. Let's see, my energy is kind of low, but that's okay. I think we could probably get through this one after. Alright, let's use another machete, which very well might be lost and then we'll have to use our hands for the rest of the trip and that would be terrible hey that's my house right there so I guess that's where we are I hope that snake didn't come out I don't know if they actually do anything apparently the bats do something and the spiders do but that seems to be the only creatures around. 
Man, we need to like call somebody <laughs> or something. Our social is so low. Can we call our friends? We don't have any friends. Yeah, we'll do it later. We'll set up the tent and call people and get our needs up and everything. Hopefully, anyway. Oh no, I forgot again about the outfits. She's got to change into her jungle outfit. I made this whole outfit for her specifically to do this in. And then I just had her in the regular clothes. Oh, she did it! What's going to happen now? Where are we getting from here? A mysterious egg! Sandra is forging through the jungle when she almost trips over a large, strange-looking egg just lying on the jungle floor. Who knows what kind of creature is inside? What should Sandra do? Examine the egg. Uh... You can poke the egg with a flower if we had one. Or we could leave the egg alone. Which doesn't seem to give any... Doesn't say what happens with each. Okay. Well, let's examine it. Alien egg. Sandra isn't sure what to make of the egg and g gives it a good shake. A soft roaring comes from the shrubs nearby. Seems like the egg's parent is a bit upset by Sandra's actions. A giant creature lunges its head out, spewing fire at Sandra. She runs to safety, but gets a little singed in the process. Oh, yikes. Oh, yikes. Well, <laughs> that didn't work out so well. Maybe we should take a little break. We could set up camp here, I guess. I think you can set it up anywhere. As far as I know. Oh man, we're gonna have some choices now. There's like three different choices we can go. Huh. What are we gonna do? Okay, we'll set up the tent. Place in the world. There you go. Use this. Just go ahead and uh, wash up a little bit. There. Well, that helps. We better eat one of our sack lunches. Oh, she can't do it. Well, let's place this in the world, too. Alright, let's... I don't know. Can we place it in the world and then eat it? Nope. What's the problem? I'm not gonna be able to eat anything. Oh, no. Oh, no. gonna happen. What? I thought I lost my machete. I'm oh, sure I did. Oh, no, no, no. Don't place that in the world. Oh, oh I have a quick... Oh, this cooler. Awesome. I don't even need these lunches then. Just throw them out. Oh, I can't grab it from the ground. Super annoying. Okay, okay. Things are... things are looking pretty good here. She'll eat her meal and then she'll go ahead and sleep, I guess. A group of fireflies is looking for their next target and they're coming for Sandra. Jake's fire quencher would be handy. Oh no. Oh no. Extinguish yourself. What in the world? Again? Again? Ugh. 
gosh, it just, okay, good. We're gonna need more of these, darn. Who knew? <laughs> All right, just try to sleep again, please. If you can make it through the night, that would be pretty good. Our hygiene is so terrible, oh my goodness. Uh, oh boy, got some spiders. Oh, I think she took care of it. Yeah, she she did the spiders. Okay, we'll put this in our inventory and put that in the inventory. Or maybe not that. I guess we should probably have a quick meal first. Let's do yogurt. Fast forward and then we'll go choose one of our jungle things. Okay. Okay, get up. Put this in the inventory. And let's go. Let's see. One, two, or three. This one looks cooler. Let's go here. should try to chat with someone because she's so lonely. It's gonna take her a little while to get over here. Oh, and her hygiene is terrible. I hope there's a bush nearby that she can go to the bathroom in. Mysterious pedestal. Sandra pulls back a curtain of vines and discovers a strange clearing in the jungle. There is a pedestal with a relic on top surrounded by circle totems. The totems' faces are fixed to the permanent snarl that strikes fear in Sandra's heart. Should she turn back or check out the totems? Um, obviously we're going to check them out. Sandra inspects the totems carefully and comes up with a plan for retrieving the relics without triggering the traps. All it takes are some vines, a ballpoint pen, and a paperclip, and she constructs a makeshift trap diffuser. The plan goes off flawlessly and she takes the cool relic with her. Very nice. Let's go to the temple. Heck yes. Oh, I'm tra I'm chatting with someone first. Oh, nice. So, here we are at the temple. Uh, we'll uh, fertilize, I think. And where was she just going to go swimming? Is that what I just saw? Huh. <laughs> I'm not sure about that one. What are our next goals here? Oh, we need to take a shower too. <laughs> we'll use that next. Anyway, back to this. Uh... Level 3 culture skill. Find an area off the path. Clear the path through the path obstacles to discover hidden areas off the main path. Okay. And examine three traps. I think we're going to have to go in the temple for this now. So here we go. Oh boy. This looks so similar to World Adventures. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. Let's see. Let's go ahead and examine some things here. Oh God, don't try to pass. No, no way. Examine this. Don't know if these things are traps or not, but yeah, whatever. Is this the water you can swim in? Uh-huh. I want to excavate some of the things, but... I don't want to waste all my time doing that because it takes so long. Oh, well, it takes so long to examine, though, too.
Okay, any day now. Did she figure it out? Some of these triggers won't work to unlock the gate, but that doesn't rule them all out. She should try her luck at activating a trigger or at keep examining other mechanisms. Hmm. And there's nothing over here, I guess. So it's just these two things? Hmm. Well, I guess we'll see what this one says, and then we'll see if we can uh, get through this electric gate. Oh, yes, level two archaeology. Any day now. Um, okay, same message as before. What's this one? Well, that was pretty easy though, actually. What are you doing? No, don't go out there. It only had one option because it says that these ones are bad. So I guess we'll do both. I don't know what it's gonna do, but we'll see. Should be pretty interesting. <laughs> What's happening? I don't know. Nothing seems to happen. Oh boy. Oh, scared of what we know. Uh oh. I took some screenshots. Oh shoot. I uh Oh she's dirty again. Activated the wrong temple. I, I bypass the... Hey! Let's clear those. That's not annoying. Alright! We cleared these! Let's go downstairs. Oh my goodness. Oh boy. Let's go ahead and examine some of these. Oh, this is an ominous place. We've got... Uh, more traps over here. This is clearly some kind of creepy path. And then we've got this. So we'll fast forward. We're also going to examine this one. And this one. It seems like only one of the... Uh, one of the traps actually opens the gate to the next area, so that's good to know. She learned nothing from that one. She learned some things from this next one. That's okay. And finally this one. Okay, well, I guess we'll try to activate it. <laughs> Doesn't seem like it works. She gained some archaeology skill. Oh, okay. Um, I guess we'll try it on this one too. And then we have like probably all the options on these ones, so that's gonna be fun to give it a try. Darts coming at her. That didn't look right either. Nope, just some more archaeology skill. Alright, here we go. Let's do the middle one. Oh. I'm gonna do the middle one. Oh no, she got hit by a door. Oh, she's turning green. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Can I do anything about it? From the poison dart. Let's see. A 
requiring an antidote. Do I have any such antidote? Because I don't think so. Oh, you can't go swimming. She's hungry, though. Alright, let's uh, just hang out for a bit. Have a quick meal of cereal. We'll just kind of let her regroup a little bit. Then we'll pull the next one. Alright, hurry up and eat now. Because we gotta go on. Get up. Put this in your inventory. Okay, let's, um... Let's try the right one, then. See how this one goes. Oh, yikes. Okay, not that one either. Well, it must be, it must be the left one. Yes, we can do it. Looking. Oh, no. What? Why did that happen? There's no other things in here. Stop, stop going somewhere. No, you're not getting in line. She doesn't have any more of her, uh... Okay, she doesn't have any more things. Oh, okay. We could study this. But what else? There's... There's nothing else in here. There's no other traps. Oh. Wait, why is this one... Oh, I just hit my mic. I'm sorry if that made a loud noise. But what is this one? I didn't notice that before. Yeah, all of those are bad. I guess I had two options here. So now I'm gonna... Um, now I'm gonna get in for sure. <laughs> Man, I should have bought more water bottles for the shower. Now, I wonder... Does it save my progress? if I leave and come back with them in my same vacation, because as far as I remember, it didn't save the progress in The Sims 3, which was terrible because you couldn't really uh, do much in the time that it gave you. You can never finish, at least I never was able to finish a uh, pyramid. They're usually so big. I think I won in the big ones though. Okay, yeah, here we go. Yay. She bypassed the defenses. And she's trying to go swimming. Open the treasure chest. Oh. Wait. I don't know about that. Hmm. Doesn't seem like there's any traps, I guess. There's some over here. That's for sure. What's going on now? <laughs> nice. Whatever she got. A wondrous item. Okay, cool. Stop trying to go swimming. What's the deal? Oh, wait a second. The swimming? Do the hygiene? Hmm, let's check it out really quick. Cause that would be cool if she could just kind of take a bath in here. <laughs> a little bit. Oh yes it does. She's going to get clean. Nice. Or not. Her hygiene bar is all the way up but it's red. So, stop swimming now, thanks. Is it because of the dirty water, maybe? I don't know. That's unusual. Her hygiene went up. <laughs> what happened? Is there... Ah, oh, here is the bush. And then I guess we'll put our tent and cooler out for the night again.
Seems like it will save my progress if I stay in this lot, though, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm actually going to end the episode for today, though. I just realized I've been recording for long enough. It's an interesting, uh, interesting temple here. So we will continue that in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel because I post Sims videos every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you in the next video. Until then, bye!